In this lesson, I'm going to teach you how to turn off your Mac. It doesn't matter if you have a MacBook Pro, a Mac Air, or a MacBook. It doesn't even really matter when you bought your Mac. They all operate the same way. So this is what my desktop looks like. And as you can see, it's kind of clean, uh, which your desktop should be as well. But I'll have another tutorial about that later. So in order to shut off your Mac, the easiest way is to press the power button on the top right hand corner of your Mac. Now that the symbol comes up right there. Now if you don't want to press that button, you can also go up to this little Apple symbol on the top left hand corner. Just click once on your trackpad or mouse click, left mouse click if you're using a mouse, and you'll see all of these options here. Just go down to shutdown. A lot of people go to logout, and after about six months of using their computer, they wonder why their computer is so slow. Well, you haven't actually turned your computer off. I find the best habit for Macs is to turn your computer off every night before you go to sleep. You can put it in sleep mode during the day, but shutdown turns everything off, and it's a good little break for your computer. So all you have to do is click once on shutdown, and this little option will come up here. You can choose reopen windows when logging back in. I never do. That basically means any programs you had open before you, uh, when you shut down, they will reopen when your computer turns on. But um, I'm not going to do that. So I would just click shut down and in about five seconds my computer would shut down. Now I want to click one more time on the Apple and show you that there is also the option to restart and there's also the option to sleep. Sleep is never really something you'll need to choose because when you close the lid of your laptop it automatically goes to sleep. Restart is generally if you find that there's a bit of an issue going on with your computer or you find that maybe your internet isn't connecting properly it's good to restart your computer and maybe that'll reset any what we call bugs or I like to call gremlins uh, in your computer. There's always something funky going on. Logging out is basically only used when you want to put your computer to sleep, but you also want to make sure it's password protected if somebody else takes your computer, opens it up, and sees, oh, there's a password there. So it's a level of security for your computer, um, but that's all it's used for. It shouldn't be used for putting your computer to sleep or shutting down. Those are separate things. And that's how you shut down, restart, or put to sleep your laptop or home computer.